Hey guys, how's it going for you from Tools and Gadgets? We're back again with another video today. I'm going to be teaching you how to edit your PDF, highlight a text, or add a signature to it. So I'm going to be showing you two ways how to do that. First off, we'll be using the native iOS Files app. So let's go ahead and open our Files app. As you can see, we have a sample PDF here. Okay, so let's just go ahead and click the pen on the lower right side of the screen. Hit plus. As you can see, there is you, you can add a sticker, add a text, add a signature, and add a shape. So usually when we annotate a PDF, we usually add a text. Let's say, let's go ahead and click add a text. Let's say, let's type in sign by click on the screen let's just go ahead and make it smaller there's here at the lower left the bottom side you could adjust the text here to make it smaller or bigger let's just place it right there then after that let's go ahead and add a signature to it so to do that let's go ahead and click plus click add signature and that's what you can see i've already had my signature here and my wife's signature. I'm just gonna blur it for security purposes. Let's go ahead and click on add or remove signature. So once there, hit the plus icon there and let's go ahead and type our new signature. Let's just go ahead and do that. Then if you're contented with that, click done and it will be added here on the PDF already, okay. So once there, you could adjust the size of the signature. All right, just like that. And when you're happy with that, or if you wanna make the signature a little bit bolder, you could do that here on the lower bottom screen. And if you're happy with that, go ahead and click done. All right, so it's already there. So what if I wanna highlight a text? Okay, so Highlighting a text, guys, is as simple as double-clicking a certain word or a paragraph or a phrase. Let's go ahead and highlight all of this. So click on highlight, then choose what color you like. Let's say I want it to be blue. And here, uh, let's go ahead and click the violet. So you would be more organized in reading your PDF. Okay, so when you're happy with that, let's go ahead and click on done. So you can see it's already highlighted there. So what if I want to add a text box? Let's go ahead and click on the plus here and let's click add text form box. Let's just say let's put it here on top. So I want to put in the name, let's say Joe Rogan okay when you hit done it's already there so it's as simple as that so if you want to sign a PDF annotate a PDF highlight a PDF or add a text form box you could use your native iOS file app here to do just that okay so let's go on to the step two okay so step two guys i would say that it would only work on the iphone version the ipad version i've tried it there already and it's not working it makes me want to uh, register for a subscription which is my tutorial is about free apps and how to use it okay so so for step two guys let's go ahead and click on microsoft 365 so if you haven't downloaded it download it and then when you open the app it lets you choose to sign in existing user or create a new user so if you have a existing microsoft 365 account just go ahead and log into that if you don't have any yet then you could go ahead and create an account so the one thing i noticed here about the th microsoft 365 is that it won't let me edit using the ipad so using the ipad i could just add a signature and annotate the pdf file but on the iphone i could do the editing i could convert it to microsoft word and then convert it back to pdf and add signature and all okay so we are now here let's go ahead and navigate to our file to do that go ahead and click on the folder at the top right corner of the screen and click on file app and then you can see your file here let's go ahead and click this second sample okay guys so we're now ready to edit so to edit this guys 
let's go ahead and click this pencil here at the top and go ahead and let's see we're just here we'll just put here hello world all right perfect so after that let's go ahead and click done and it would still be in a word document file so in order to convert it to pdf let's go ahead and click on the three dots here at the top click on export and export as pdf so take note guys it would save on your onedrive app so the, in order to save it on your phone let's go ahead and click on files app and navigate to your folder let's go ahead and click on this type on sample 3 perfect so it's now on pdf file let's go ahead and click on the files app let's go and click on pdf a sample pdf 3 you can see there's now the hello world so we have successfully edited the PDF file using Microsoft 365. At first, it would convert to Microsoft Word. Then after editing using the Microsoft document file, then you could export it back to a PDF file. So that's the only way that you can edit a PDF file using your iPhone for free, guys. Take note once again, I would say that you could not do this on the iPad. I have tried doing it on the iPad. It wouldn't let me. It would let me choose a subscription since I don't have any subscription yet on my microsoft 365 so on our iphone it works perfectly well you can edit your pdf just like as a paid subscription on other apps which is pretty great all right guys so that's about it thank you for watching guys if you have any questions or suggestions write them down below and see you again in our next vlog bye